So I stay active and physically fit at home uh, via a couple ways. So one, I do fitness martial with my sister. Hey all. <laughs> we love Caleb, we love fitness martial, it's so fun. Um, I'm also very blessed, we have some free weights at my house, so I've been able to get some workouts in with free weights and a yoga ball. I also love yoga with Adrian, so I've been doing yoga with Adrian as well. So yoga, some free weights, and fitness martial are ways that I like to stay fit. And then every once in a while I'll go on a run or I'll do jump rope, but those are the main ways. I think you can stay active a variety of different ways. I know right now um, you guys can do your research, but right now a lot of companies are offering free fitness classes online, which is great. Um, and free memberships and trials and all that, that thing. So I think if you guys were going to try anything at home, now is the time to be doing that. Um, and yeah, we can look up, honestly, there's so many different workouts on Instagram and Pinterest and all that stuff. And it's really easy to find a lot of different ways. But I think the biggest thing right now is just keep moving. And it's hard when you're locked in your house and all that stuff, but keep active, go on walks, um, stretch, do yoga. There's a lot of things that you can do out there. Grab your mom, grab your dad, make them pepper with you. Um, but yeah, it could be kind of fun. During these times, we're all at home, the gyms are closed, so I have been doing a lot of online videos. Uh, just to get, keep the blood moving, I've done HIIT workouts for the first time, um, just to get a good sweat. And luckily I have um, a garage gym in the back, so I'm able to get full workouts and our coaching staff was able to kind of warn us that this was gonna happen. So we took a lot of things from our normal Team USA gym home with us. And so we're very fortunate to have some heavy weights so we can maintain our muscle. Um, in terms of staying fit and physically active, I've been trying to create a schedule and a routine for myself to make that a little bit easier. Um, for cardio, I love getting outside, going on a run or doing a bike ride. I think it's super easy to get the heart rate up. Um, in terms of maintaining muscle and trying to strengthen it further, body weight exercises are great. I know a lot of people have been posting their workouts on different social media platforms, so Watching those has been super awesome and learning new things that I can incorporate into my own workouts has been super helpful. So even just watching some videos online and learning from that has been great. Uh, I've been lucky that um, I had quite a bit of stuff at home to do kind of a lot of home workouts. So from what I was doing in the weight room um, before this all stopped, I've been able to pretty much continue with that. So um, every morning at 8 a.m. I do a nice little Zoom call with my strength coach and um, go through my workout and four sets and some ESD and jump on the Peloton before. Um, to do a little warm-up ride and yeah it's it's been a nice little little routine for me so how you can stay physically fit and active during this time is um, I think an important thing is to find an accountability partner I'm lucky enough to be on a team where I have a lot of teammates who are in the same position as me who are just trying to find ways to um, stay in shape um, without leaving the house I think that's a good thing and then also there are so many resources on the internet that you can find at home workouts especially for people who don't have a lot of equipment at home that's been my biggest saving grace is just finding workouts that i can do without needing all of this extra equipment during this quarantine time when all the gyms are closed and it's really hard to stay physically fit i think it's super important to be really self-conscious about what you're doing i think that obviously you can go out for walks and go for runs and just doing at-home workouts is really important to get that adrenaline going and get the body flowing again. Today's day and age with everything digital and online, it's so easy to find workouts to do for yourself at home, whether it be yoga or a HIIT workout. Um, really what your heart desires, you can find and, and do something at home. But beyond that, if you can be safe and smart about it, I think getting outside is great. Whether it's going for a walk, a run, a bike ride, um, practicing social distancing, of course, but um, yeah, getting outside and being active. Yeah, I do, you know, yoga. I do a little workout, whether it's to get a HIIT workout and get my heart rate up, or if it's more of like a weight training day, or if it's jumping rope, or, you know, anything to stay active. Um, yeah, I just, I try to kind of build up a plan with the, um, my weight trainer, uh, Jimmy Stitz, and he's been really good with helping us adjust. Um, giving us some phases or some at-home workouts to help us out. To stay active, I think it's just important to have a good mindset and good discipline. Uh, you can go online and look up YouTube videos of different workouts that you can do. There's yoga online. Um, and I think it's also fun to like 
do it with your friends and teammates. Um, there's Zoom that you can all do it together with, which is really fun. Ways that I'm staying active and fit during this time, um, you know, I don't have access to a gym right now, like many of you guys. So I'm just doing a lot of body weight workouts, band workouts, um, you know, using random objects that are a little bit heavier to um, still try and get a lift in as much as I can. Um, but I'm also getting outside a lot more than I normally do. So I'm going on a lot of walks. I take my dog on walks and um, going on runs.